back to the go channel. I'm adjusting the camera real fast. Let me. Uh, I was watching UFC. Jacques Ray just got his arm broke when I was watching this, or right before I'm filming this. UFC 262. Uh, Jacques Ray, by far one of my favorite fighters of all time, snapped it clean. Uh, but we're back for a whiskey tasting. Uh, I was tough to see. Uh, but this one will come out way after that. But you'll know what I'm talking about. This is another one from Lost Distilling. Now, uh, we did this. Um, we did the rum before. Now we're doing a 1784 White 100 Proof Tennessee Whiskey. Whiskey distilled from bourbon mash. Distilled and bottled. Here's some detail. Aged for a minute and used white oak barrels. So let me tell you a little backstory of this one. Now, this one comes from down at the Lost Distilling. The cool thing about this one is they actually have this thing you can purchase right now. 300 spots available. You can buy it in the white version, you can go the second. Basically, you can buy this package deal for $500 and you get two of each bottle, but you get it at each, each step of aging. So you can buy it at your clear, then you can buy it at six months, one year, two year, three year, and four year. So you get two bottles of each one, you get a container, you get a glass, all that stuff. They are part of the whiskey trail in Tennessee. Uh, so if you want to check that out. But yeah, that's the cool thing about it. This is just the white. That's their first version. They have a three month. I mean, they have a six months already out. One year is in August. And then two, three, and four. And you can get all those for $500, two of each. But it's a really cool experience. Because you can, you can taste it through the process. So that's pretty neat. This is what we're looking at. Just a clear white whiskey. Pretty much a, uh, pretty close to a moonshine. It's, it's a very easy going down. Pretty tasty. It's a little, a um, little less burn than moonshine. Probably, uh, it almost has that moonshine flavor, but not necessarily that corn flavor that you would get from a straight moonshine or a corn moonshine or a corn whiskey. So this clear, you can definitely tell where it'll go once it starts getting aged. I don't know if I had the six months or not i think i might have had the six months but yeah they they let you try it there and this one's just their starter so you know this is what they start with 50 percent alcohol 100 proof tennessee whiskey um very it's pretty smooth definitely up front smooth got a little burn to it It's kind of got, and the thing, it's kind of got a really, it's got a little hint of a sweet taste to it. So, you know, you could buy it just like this. Like I said, I bought this, I don't know, I think it's 20 bucks. You could be, buy it straight white. Um, but I really think the process of the $500 would be neat with this. The go rating on this one, um, just basically regular alcohol, plain. You know, there's not much to it, not much burn. Got good flavor. Sometimes you get too much burn or too much, uh, sometimes you can get bad flavor out of them. I mean, that's the honest truth. I've had bad ones before. Uh, this one's fairly smooth. Doesn't taste like your regular moonshine, so it is a different, I mean, white Tennessee whiskey. It's definitely got a different flavor than just a regular moonshine. 
So we're going to have to go with the GOAT rating of, I think it's 7.4. Um, it's not bad. Pretty simple. Pretty straightforward. And you can taste where they're going to go with it, though. I guarantee after you get in a barrel, should stick it in this thing, but after you get in a barrel, you're definitely going to be able to um, kind of taste where it's going with it. So I'd go with 7.4 for just a straight white 100 proof. Um, so yeah, I, I, I didn't buy the $500 thing, but it is very tempting. Um, it's something I'm thinking about buying. So if, you, if you're up for that experience, go to Lost State Distilling, get there. Um, whole package deal, you know. So, this one gets a 7.4 from me. What's the gut rating? 7.4. Let's take one more sip. Yeah, it's pretty straightforward. I mean, you know, there's nothing to it. Um, just pretty simple, clear. Um, easy to sip on, probably an easy mixer. One other thing they have down there on some of their alcohols is pretty cool because they they put what percentage of each thing is in it. So like wheat, corn, uh, whatever, they put the percentage of actually what goes into their alcohol. So that's another neat thing about them. But yeah, what's the goat rating? 7.4. This is 1784 Tennessee White Whiskey. This is the Go Channel. We out.